In Bloxy 2, e-commerce features have been revamped and this brings the new product brands feature to the suite. It couldn't be easier to get started as it is a simple implementation that anybody can understand. The product brands module is available for all of our Bloxy Pro subscribers on the professional or agency package as it is part of the Shop Extra extension. Okay, let's get started. First, let's turn on the module. Navigate to your WordPress dashboard, click on Bloxy, choose Extensions, find the Shop Extra extension and make sure it is turned on. Then look for the Product Brands module down the list and turn that on as well. Once it has been turned on, you will find the new Brands menu under the Products tab on the left. As you can see, the view kind of looks like any custom taxonomy you may have added in the past. On the right, you can see the brands that have been added so far with a few empty fields on the left where you can add a new brand. Let's add a demonstration brand name. Fill in the details. Notice that you also get a custom image field, which you can assign to a brand name. This is useful for visually representing your brands. We'll add a demo image here as well. Products are now ready to be assigned to this new brand. Jump to the main products view and edit any of the existing ones or create a new one as needed. Once you scroll down the page, you will see a new section called Brands. Here is where you can assign your product to a brand. Let's assign this product to our newly created brand and save the changes. It's time to switch to the customizer to see which options are available for displaying on the front end. First, you can display the brands in the product archives as an information layer. To enable this, go to the Product Archives tab, choose Cart Options, and then look for the Brands Information layer. You can use the little eye icon to toggle it on or off. Depending if you have added an image to the brand, it may show up as a little visual icon or a simple text line. There are also some granular control options if you expand the layer. On a side note, the Product Brands integration can also be shown in our product filters. We would recommend checking out our sister video for those to find out more about this topic. Second, you can also show product brands on the single product page. To enable this, go to the single product tab, choose product elements and turn on the brands information layer. And as you can see, it is displayed on the right in the product information box. And as a little bonus, product brands also get their very own archives. So you can direct users easily to a specific brand where needed. That would be pretty much it. It's an awesome system that gives you more categorization and customization options for your products. Easy categorization using the product brands module. If you wish to learn more about what Bloxy2 has to offer, continue on onto our website or click on one of our other videos to keep watching.